everybody, it's me, Chat with Sitara, and today I'm giving a book review of The Messenger by Lois Lowry. It's also the third book in the Giver Quartet. The main character in this book is Maddie. Maddie lives in an altruistic society. Everybody is nice and welcoming. He lives with his caregiver, an old blind man called Seer. He was helping the seer with housework, and he also serves as a messenger to send messages to people across the forest. The village suddenly changes because of a plate called Trademart. Maddie's friend Ramon tells him about a gaming machine his parents got from the Trademart. Maddie pleads with the seer to go there and get one. Finally, the seer lets him go, but he can't trade for anything because it is dangerous. He sees how dangerous it is. People are trading parts of themselves, such as their honor or spirit, for worthless objects. The people of the society started to become unwelcome and mean. The forest became unwelcoming and it started to kill and hurt people. The society's leaders announced that the society was going to close to outsiders, so nobody who doesn't live there can come inside. One day, Maddie's friend Jean offers him a puppy from her dog's litter. They all get sick and all of them die except one. He touches the puppy and it is healed. The seer needed Maddie's help to find the seer's daughter, Kira, and bring her to the village before the borders close. He goes in the forest. He finally finds Kira, but her leg is hurt. She refuses for him to heal her, because being limp is a part of her. The forest becomes more hostile when they start going back. Kira's feet are cut, and Maddie gets burned by acidic tree sap. The forest plans to kill both of them. Kira has a gift of seeing the future. She uses her gift to talk to the leader of the society. Maddie uses his gift and heals the forest, also healing the entire society. He becomes weak because he used so much energy to heal the forest and society and he dies soon. Afterwards, before he dies, Leader says Maddie's true name is Healer. He sacrificed his life to save the forest. I learned to be generous and help others from this book, even putting my life on the line. I really enjoyed this book, and the whole series is actually really good. If you like Lois Lowry and her work, you should read this book and the series. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!